you motherfuckers know about the deep woods? Bitch, I know everything! This is Hiker Dobby's territory! Ah! <laughs> it is up, everybody! My name is Dom, and this is Fears to Fathom the Iron Bark Lookout. This is the latest in the in the Fears to Fathom series of games, and apparently, motherfuckers, we're working in what looks like some kind of watchtower in the middle of the woods. Pray for my bitch ass, cause you know I'm fixing to get tossed. Now, before we get into this gameplay, I do really quickly want to mention that I know a couple of you motherfuckers are already typing, and you know what I'm gonna say. Stop fucking typing! Dom, y'all are asking, Dom! Dom, where is the latest uh, Dead Signal video? Where is it? Where is it, bitch? We're at 2,000 likes. Okay, couple things, motherfucker. Number one, the marathon is fully completed. Okay, we beat the casual gameplay. It's done. Number two, I am actively, as I'm recording, well, not as I'm recording this video, but I'm in the process of beating that game on normal mode, so that will be coming very soon. Okay, hang tight, hang tight, bitches. We're working on the set. Now, let's run this gameplay because this is what you're getting today. Let's hit the bitch. Yes! Oh my god, bitch! My chair wasn't locked. Yes! Motherfucker! Get out! Woo! Okay, y'all. Here we go! Here we go. May 12th. Hey, I noticed you were requesting story submissions while I was watching a YouTuber play Fears to Fathom Carson House. What I'm about to recount happened uh, when I was 24 or so at the time. It's kind of weird telling anybody about this because of the bizarre and absurd nature of the whole thing, but I feel like doing so might help me process my memories of it. I knew that sharing this story anywhere else would be a dumb idea because people would say I was lying. As I am writing this, it was the scariest experience of my life. Okay, so Bitch Bitch McGee about to type some paragraphs to me! Now, before we continue reading this, which I will do momentarily, I just want to mention that if y'all have not seen any of my past Fears to Fathom episodes, I got a link down below! Probably, maybe not! Google that shit! Sorry, YouTube that shit. Don plays Fears to Fathom, it'll come up. Let me continue. I'm Jack Nelson. I thought it said Jack Nicholson. I was gonna say, no way they got the budget for that shit. Stop! I had a small job as a park ranger in a state park. I was in a fire lookout station in one of the biggest forests in the Pacific Northwest. Miles and miles of dense forest managed by the Forestry Service. I had a salary that allowed me to make ends meet, but couldn't afford to treat myself to restaurants, nice clothes, etc. My biggest accomplishment so far was being able to buy an RV for myself with a lot of financial help from my dad. That RV was the only sense of home I had at the time. This one time, I was transferred from one of the outposts to another because of some official circumstances. It was a minor inconvenience to me though, since I lived out of my RV and I liked traveling. I said a few goodbyes and I was off to a new location. It was about a two hour drive. Okay, I'm clicking. Press any key. Motherfucker, no! Oh, 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 oh I thought it crashed, bro. Okay, so I'm, I'm driving the RV and previously I was looking down at my lap, which I can just not imagine, is, how you're supposed to drive an RV, but you know what, bitch? I didn't crash, so who the fuck cares? Read the- Okay, so I'm gonna text and drive. Y'all know this shit's not a game. Let me go ahead and do that shit. Oh, wow, I'm still driving, bitch. Okay, well, I'm obviously not gonna text and drive. What am I, some kind of fucking idiot? Uh, I lived a solitary life. Okay, look, I'm still commentating down to the bottom. It helps quiet my mind and keep the memories at bay. Okay, not gonna lie. The subtitles to the bottom while driving a motor vehicle sounds a little bit dangerous, motherfucker. Now looky here, we got a goddamn 4x4 four four big ass truck. That's not the right term. It's a semi, bitch. Let me, 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 let me hold and read this text message real quick. Okay, there is a minimum speed at which you can drive, it seems like. I always love the great outdoors. No, just kidding, I stopped. Okay, let me read this shit. Um, oh wow. Okay, this shit's dead ass, bro. Come on, gang. Come on, gang. This guy's still typing down to the bottom. I was at home in the woods. Okay, well, obviously, I'm not gonna be able to read those text messages, motherfucker. I'll, I'll read them whenever we stop. I'll, I'm assuming we're gonna get there eventually. Did that sign just materialize, or am I bugging? Uh, let me let me just keep driving, bro. There there was like 14 paragraphs on that ass, and last time I feel like when I was reading those, they didn't mean fuck all to me. Okay, now look, Kayla texted me. She horny, probably, but that's okay. She can wait till I stop, bitch. Let me keep it moving. I'm hoping this isn't one of them games where like. You can only progress if you read the text messages, because in that case, I'm going to be stopping in the middle of the road, bitch. I'm not trying to get terminated by a, by a 72-foot semi. I saw the diner Kayla was talking about. Am I supposed to stop? Oh, shit! I missed the diner at first. Okay, so I, I do need to go back. 
Okay, so I do need to go back. Okay, first of all, the goddamn slow-mo zoom-in on the damn Dino would have been way more... I just crashed. I should have taken it easy. Uh, uh, it would have been way more useful to me if it would have actually stopped me and helped me get into the Dino. I'm... I'm in the middle of the shit, bro. Okay, I'm literally crashing. I just did a 72 point turn. Okay, let me get over here to the diner. Oh my god, this bitch got no turning radius. Oh my god, look at the pickup speed. I'm flooring it right now, gang. I'm flooring it. This is not a meme to me. I'm flooring it. Okay, hold up, hold up here, hold up here. I'm literally parking right in front. I do not give a shit. I'm getting out. Get me out. Wait. Oh, get up. Okay, so here's my RV. Y'all know what's popping. Uh, this is definitely an illegal park job, but as far as I'm concerned, don't care. Okay, who the fuck is Mitch and why is he texting me so much? Congratulations on transferring. Ready for a change. Uh, you're signed to Tower 11. Welcome aboard. This is Mitch, by the way, from my Iron Bark. Very excited. I get my ID today. Your ship starts on the 12th. Sounds good to me. I'll be there. Anything I need to know. I have your papers. Just bring your ID. Josh told me... The job is not news to you. Can I just ask you one question? Sure. Why did you pick the job initially? Not sure how to answer that. I enjoyed the thrill or the lack of it, I guess. I'm sorry. Just uh, somebody joining this line of work. Interested to hear people joining, looking for a getaway to discover, only to be left uh, without notice. Okay, I guess it's better off than a cubicle. To be honest, Iron Horse last year. Expected solitary life grown on me. For me, city life is where is not where I belong. Okay, adapting to Iron Bark. Right. So you get here on Friday. Okay, where can I park my van? So you're arriving on Friday. Just park out of the gravel by Gate D. Got it. From there, you'll be on foot. Take the Gold Creek Trail, and from there, it'll be a couple hours until you reach the tower. Okay, got it. Thanks. You'll probably see Billy at the gate. Just show him your ID. Holy God. Okay, so we out here. Gombas. Satan. This new regional manager is a jerk. Honestly, job. I wish I had a job like you. Waking up in nature, get paid. I uh, wish my job was really that easy. Honestly, uh, I'm done with this job. Pretty sure I'm joining you next season. Okay, yada yada. Definitely a good change of pace. Speaking of a change. Uh, okay, this is his new ID, apparently. They are stepping me at Iron Bark. The one after Rosebug. Yeah, I heard bigger staff, more cabins. Call me. With dad, I'll call you back. How's it looking? On my way, pulled a flat tire. Isn't it late? Don't starve. Uh, did you pass Roseburg yet? No. Why? There's a diner there. They have the best burgers in town. You have to try them out. I can really use a good meal before my staffing starts. Thanks, Kay. Okay, that was cringe! Bro, oh my god. Give me my five minutes of my life back, motherfucker. Literally, literally, literally nothing of importance at all, bro. At all. Absolutely unbelievable gameplay. Okay, let's get to it, bro. Let's get to the diner. Let's get to the diner. Who is that bitch? She's looking like this is shit in 1982. Welcome to the Twin River Diner. Uh, how are you doing today? Uh, I'm good. How are you? Feel free to take any seat uh, you like, and I'll be right with you. Okay, thanks. Okay, so homegirl's right there. I'm just gonna go ahead and sit down, get some grub, and hit the road, baby case. Come on now. Okay, so you can already tell we got a creep across from us. Maybe I shouldn't have sat here. Good evening, I'm Barbara. Are you ready to order? Uh, yeah. Let me get the cheeseburger with fries. Uh, our burger is the best in the West. Uh, would you like anything to drink? Coffee? Let's go coffee. Perfect. Anything else? That would be all. Thank you. Uh, great. I'll bring you the food out as soon as possible. Just let me know if you need anything else. We'll do. Okay. So here we go. We ordered the burger. Best one in the West. I've always had a habit of peeing before eating. Okay, so that's clearly a cue for me to get my motherfucking ass up and go eat. This guy eat like an absolute ghoul. Why the fuck he got a goddamn shovel in this bitch? I'm about to change my table, but I'm about, I'm about to sit back over here. All right, let me hit the bathroom real quick. I really had to pee. Is that door lock or? Okay, so no kind of lock mechanic on that ass. Oh, wow. Damn, boy, I'm shooting a pistol at this motherfucker. Okay. I'm pretty sure in every single one of these video games so far, you've either shitted or pissed. I think the developer has like a little, uh, has like a little kink for, for adding this into the game. So get kind of a little freak, but that's all right. Okay, I was done with it. Let me get a hand wash in and then we'll go sit down. Okay, come on now. Come on now, take it too damn long to wash them hands, but squirt, squirt, move. That's, that's how I wash my shits, bro. I'm actually going to sit over here, gang. I'm going to sit over here. I, I'm not really a big fan of Creepo McGee. I was in the wrong booth. Fuck! Okay. So I do got to go sit in my proper booth. Straight across from Creepo McGee. I'm going to go ahead and turn my back to him. Oh, okay, it's not going to let me. Okay, so I'm going to have to be in direct eye contact with Bucko Magoo over there. 
uh, which is rather unlucky. But that's fine. I guess we'll just wait it out. Wait it out. Should have read my damn note in here. Should have read my damn text messages in here, because this shit's taking forever. Look at how slow she's walking. What the hell? This bitch thing, I got all the time in the world. Come on, now what's going on now? Thank you very much. Damn, she put her, she put it in the box too to go. This meal do look exquisite. Well, I got mayo, ketchup, and fry sauce, looks like. I figured it'd be a while before I had a meal like this again. Okay, so I got a me to eat that grub up game, bro. Okay, there goes the waitress. She's stopping to check in on me. Okay, let's see. Let me go ahead and drink this coffee. I'm assuming she's about to give my bill, so let me just finish eating real quick. Oh, I hoovered this motherfucker up. No joke, not a game. Okay, so she was just checking in on me. There goes that fella into the bathroom. No worries here. Okay, so let's see. I'm here still eating. This is so good. Did you enjoy your food? Yeah, it was great. Would you like to have anything else, or should I get the check? Check, please. Okay, I'll be right back. Perfect, perfect. Thanks, thanks. So got another text message. Told you, hee hee. Uh, this food reminds me. You should send me that casserole recipe you were talking about. Might get a chance to immerse myself in the art of cuisine at the new lookout. Okay, well, didn't the guy in the who hired me and my boss at this new tower tell me that that shit was two hours on the trail or whatever? I'm not, I'm not gonna be doing no shit like that, Bo. Uh, here's your check. Total is $6.60. Let's pay it with a 15% tip. Okay, she was reasonable. She wasn't great. She was kind of slow. Hope you enjoyed the rest of your ride. Appreciate that. All right, so we paid for my meal. Let's hit the streets. This guy left the bathroom door open. He's insane. Didn't that guy go into the bathroom? Why am I bugging? Well, this guy talking to himself. Oh, yeah, he having a conversation. Yo! Or he's eating. I don't know what he's doing. He kind of looks like Bigfoot. Let me stop judging, motherfuckers. Let me keep moving. Man was kind of built like a gorilla, though. Let's not lie. Did I leave this door open? The bathroom door was strangely jammed. Oh, there's nothing strange about it, bro. Well, unjam it! Okay, so this guy's in my fucking RV. Okay, so we uh, we already know that's the case, bro. Okay, let's not even let's not even act brand new. We are in the process of being stalked. Like the fact that my bathroom door is jammed and I'm not even gonna attempt to unjam it, Loki insane. But whatever. Okay, clearly they gotta set you up. This is a horror game, and that's how they do it. Okay, let me go ahead and hit a 72 point turn here through this guy's front yard. My man, what the fuck out? Hope you got homeowners insurance, you bitch. Okay, so just committing a couple felonies on my way out of town. Y'all know what the shit is, bro. Oh my god, the brakes on this thing are non-existent. It's fucking insane. But you break and you roll for 45 minutes afterwards. Okay, let me get out of the wrong lane here before I crash and die. 8.02 p.m. Okay, here we go. Becoming nighttime. Just about time for Creepo McGee to pop out on me. This reminds me of what the, what the hell is that movie? Or it might be like a Simpsons episode, honestly. Or it might be both. Uh, where like, I think... Some guy like follow, like latches onto the bottom of somebody's car and follows them, like to wherever they're going. That's what this shit reminds me of. But I don't want to seek out the other horrors I've seen in the woods. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, so I, I don't really know what that said at the bottom. Something about something about is this where I'm supposed to park at? Hold up. Is that supposed to park by gate D? I cannot read that sign, bro. Okay, whatever, whatever. Let me just keep it moving. I drove past the trail at first. Fuck. Okay, so that is where I'm going. Let me stop. Let me pull the brake and let me move, gang. Okay, so let me grab my bag. Let's get moving. Should I, like, turn off the lights in my RV or we're just gonna say fuck it? But who, ne who needs who needs a battery anyway? Okay, so I've stopped. I'm supposed to come over here and check in with homeboy. And then I'm presumably not gonna hit the trail because it's 8 o'clock at night, right? That would make less than no sense. Okay, I've done a lot of hiking. Night hiking included. That shit is cringe, bro. You do not want to be doing that if you don't have to. Oh, God! Holy moly, you scared me. I thought you were one of them. Okay, first of all, motherfucker, you have a pop out on my ass like that again. I'm gonna terminate that ass. Dom, relax. You scared me. One of who? What do you mean? Well, I'm saying one of who. May Lord have mercy. What is this guy talking about? Anyways, can I see your permit, please? I'm not a camper. Triple dot. I'm transferred to the new fire lookout. Is that correct? I didn't know we were hiring this season. Well, you are. Hang on, let me check on that. What the hell, that guy? That guy got a sawed-off shotgun in the fucking Ranger booth. What the hell is he doing? This guy's out of his fucking mind, bro. 
Why, why, why do I got my bag? I mean, I, I understand I got my bag because I picked it up. Stop typing! But what I'm saying is there's no way I'm going to hike out there in the middle of the night. That's literally the dumbest shit I've ever seen. Okay, pal. You're good to go. You're staffed at Fire Tower 11. I apologize for the confusion. I was under the impression that the tower would be left unstaffed for the season, but here are your keys. Okay, so my man got me my keys. Let me open the trail gate for you. Bro, I'm not hiking. It's 11, It's 8.02 p.m. I'll hike in the morning. This shit's insane. Since you're arriving this late, you might also need a flashlight for the long hike to the lookout. Uh, I thought I might need one. Thank you, Billy. Uh, be careful. Take this. Okay, let me go ahead and tell you right now. This never happened. Okay, this story never happened. At least not this part. Okay, I understand that these Fears to Fathom stories must be based on real life shit. Now, for our purpose, when you get to your tower, be sure to make your first weather report from the system, just so we know you're clocked in safely. If need be, you can reach out to Tower 12 during the staffing. Nice enough guy. Uh, he'll be your closest contact in case of any birds. Thank you, Billy. Okay, so let me go ahead and tell you something, Bo. Wait, why is he triple dotting me? Hey, just a piece of advice. Don't travel any further than a half a mile or so uh, north of your tower. Why? Dangerous woods that way, pal. Bobcats and bears. Nasty business. You got it. Okay. So let's go ahead and hit the trail. I thought he was trying to scare me, but he looked dead serious. Okay, again, I understand that maybe the developer of this game has never been out in the woods, done some kind of hiking, or, like, spent a lot of time in the woods. NOBODY HIKES IN DARK! Okay, I'm telling you right fucking now, as somebody who's done hundreds, thousands of miles, bitch! It was a long hike, and I was starting to get cold. Nobody hikes in the middle of the night. Unless you absolutely have to, nobody's doing that. Why does this, why is this game accessing my microphone? Fuck yourself. Okay, developer! If you can hear me right now and you're like secretly recording me, fuck yourself! Okay, because I'm pretty sure that's what's happening right now, gang. Uh, these bitches just access my microphone. Why'd they do that? Okay, so an abandoned camper. What is this? What am I doing? Wait, what am I doing? Am I going the wrong way? What, what, just, what, what the fuck? Anyway, what I was saying was, bro, nobody, absolutely nobody, hikes in the middle of the night, so this story is fabricated. Okay, at least this part. Maybe everything else is true. Uh, or maybe, maybe they're just hamming it up for the gameplay. Okay, either way, nobody does this. Okay, I, I know I'm beating a dead horse on that shit, but I'm telling you, nobody does this. Okay, I've done it one time in my life. It was fucking cringe. Iron Bark Lookout, Tower 1170 feet. Okay, let's get up. Let's move it around. Living in a fire tower is not a glamorous job. Imagine being out here all alone for weeks at a time. It's not for everybody. I can understand that. I can understand that. Is this the same fire tower from, uh... What the hell is that game? But I have a fondness for the outdoors. I ascended to the top of the tower. Um, is this the same fucking watchtower from... What is it? Do you copy? It, it reminds me of that. Once you're at the top of the tower, your job is to look for fires or anything out of the ordinary. Okay, well, let me go ahead and use my tower key. I clicked it there for a second, but it didn't work. So is there another entrance, or did I use the wrong button? Oh, okay, so let me go ahead and open up the windows so I can see out. Okay, I don't need to be all claustrophobic in this bitch. Now, is there a piece of wood to block the stairs? There is not. Okay, so let's go ahead and open this up. Close it up. The cabin was filled with the aroma of wood, giving me a sense of comfort. All right, so let me just go ahead and pitch my shit to the corner here. Okay, got my goodie bag. I was finally in my new home for the next few months. All right, let's go ahead and lock that door. I'm assuming that bitch must auto-lock. I forgot to turn on the generator first. Okay, let me just go ahead and be preemptive. I guarantee that bitch gonna be out of gas. Okay, I know the setup, bitch! I played enough goddamn horror games in my day to know the bullshit signs when the bullshit signs be showing. You know what I'm saying, bitch? I, my, my bullshit senses were tingling. Let me fuel that ass up. Let me fuel that ass up. We're gonna act like I didn't need it. There you go, bitch. I'm pouring it on the ground. I'm a fucking idiot now. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna leave the fuel down here. Okay, I know I'm gonna need it. Oh my god, I can't reach it. I was gonna say, I threw it in the no man zone. Let me put it right there. I had to report for tonight. Okay, so let me set out. Uh, static. The radio equipment was sitting on the wooden table. Wait, I didn't turn the light on. Wait a second, wait a second. Let me get up real quick. Let me turn off my flashlight and turn on the internal lights. 
There we go. Is that flashlight just gonna stay permanently in my field of vision like that? Cause that's gonna be cringe! Dami, don't be a hater. What is this? Uh, something's initializing. I don't know what that means or what's happening. Starting Rainbow 98. Okay, not the knockoff, but... What's my password? Check the Iron Bark Rules Flyer. That's basic enough. Let me check the Iron Bark Rules Flyer. Oh, this shit here. All lookouts must follow these rules while occupying this tower. Lights out after midnight. Supply drops are handed out every Sunday. Absolutely no guests in the lookout. System password is Iron Bark Tower Number. Refuel the generator routinely. Update the reporting software routinely. No video games in the system. Remember to call the sister station before you sleep. Uh, ask for extra supplies. Call John tomorrow. Send photos to Mitch. Call Billy. Request comm support. Call Jonah. Okay, understood. So, Iron Bark Tower 11. I don't. What time is it? Iron Bark 11. That was the password. Okay, in case anybody want to hack my windows. Excuse me. Rainbow 98 system. That's my password. Okay, let's do a service report here real quick. Hello there. It's Smiley, your trusty virtual assistant. Here to help you get the most out of your computer today. Clickety click. Here's a random. Don't care. Uh, how can I make your day better? Clickety click. Here's a fuck yourself. Okay, all right. So this little bitch need to get off my screen. Shut up! Oh, now he's actually giving me real tips. Oh, wait, somebody conversate. Okay, so... You guy, I haven't gotten your name yet. What is it again? Uh, I'm Jack. I saw your light turn on. I gotta say, it's refreshing to see Tower 11 alive again. Yeah, ooh, who's this? I'm Connor, Fire Tower 12. Ah, uh, why am I saying you were watching? Of course he's fucking watching me, that's his job, am I stupid? Isn't that the job? I've had to cover your area until you arrived. Anyways, what brings you to this towering paradise of ours? Uh, just looking for a change. I'm a an experienced transfer from Iron Horse. I can see why Mitch picked you. You got a fire going? Get her lit. The temperature's about to plummet. You don't want to sit through the storm shivering. Storm? Got it, thanks. Okay, so my man, I've already made a bestie. Boy, I've already made my new bestie. Okay, bitch Prince McGee already forgot his name over in the other tower next to me. Okay, we good. He a nice fella. We like that. Uh, I'm assuming... I <laughs> need smoke. Did you light it up yet? I'M WORKING ON IT, BITCH! There's no fire. The should be around the entrance. Get her lit. Oh, this guy, oh, this guy's surveying my location. You know what, I appreciate that, but okay, good guy trying to help me on my first day on the job. Uh, I'm thinking I'm probably gonna have to go downstairs and get some wood. White bitch going beep it to beep, beep it to beep. There's no fire. Firewood? There must be plenty in the shack. That's all Marley did. Marley? The staffer who was in the lookout before you. Ah. She was one gritty woman. I believe that. Anyways, you better get that fire going. You don't want to sit through the storm. Gasoline must be in your cabin. But if not, you can always grab your supplies from the storage shack. Okay, bet, 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 bet. Okay, so let me go ahead. Well, I don't really know what I need gasoline for, okay? I'm a fucking forest ranger. I can start a fire without no damn gasoline. Okay, so let me go ahead, take it downtown, grab a couple pieces of wood, and, um, keep doing my shit. Okay, the fact that this toilet's down here is a little bit demented. I'm gonna leave that door open. If that door's ever closed, we know we got a Code 37 situation. Am I? That's not going in there. How do you? I don't, I don't understand how I walk up to the generator closer to be able to pour that. That's not going in, bro. That's a me. They're lying. That's not working. Let me come over here and get some firewood real quick. So that we can be prepared for the storm. All right. Here we go. Left mouse button to place it in the stove. Okay, so let me take it up. The guy who's uh, living in my RV, probably living in the lap of luxury right now. That bitch got an RV all to himself for the next whatever, however many months. Bitch really hit the jackpot, bro. That's insane. Okay, so let me go ahead and use this. I need to light it up. Trying to do that, bitch. Left mouse button to light it up. Uh, do I gotta do I gotta gas this shit? Okay, so I really am an O'Hulahan, bro. Okay, so I really am an O'Hulahan. I need gas to start the fire. That's great, bitch. Okay, you'll notice that looks strangely close to PP. I'm telling you, the developer got some kind of kink going on, gang. Okay, they, that that looks exactly like the PP, bro. Why is this not lighting? Oh, I got a right mouse button. 
Oh my god, bitch. Okay. Oh, so I'm throwing these bitches dead ass. Okay, I kinda like that, I'm not gonna lie. I kinda like that, I'm not gonna lie. I see it. I see the smoke. Oh, this guy fucking dedicated to the craft! You know what? I appreciate that. Nice to see Tower 11 alive again. You already said that. Did you report for the night yet? Not yet. Okay, so I need to get over there and conversate with my new bestie, bro. And honestly, I appreciate it. I think some people might find this annoying. I don't. Okay, I, I appreciate this, bro. Did you report for the night yet? Uh, no. Let me get to it. it Here at Iron Bark, you are required to report every night before signing off. Gotcha. You don't want to disappoint Mitch on your first night. Why isn't Mitch's name uppercase? Shouldn't it be uppercase? Let me stop. Okay. Sit down. Let's do the report. How do I know the temperature? How do I know the temperature? Measure the weather condition with the equipment provided and log accurate data that will be sent for evaluation to the HQ. Okay, where's my where's my equipment at, bro? Uh, okay. Uh, looking for a thermometer. Presumably, it should probably be outside since I got a heater going on inside. And that would definitely modify the temperature. Oh, here we go. Look. The fuck is this? Oh, it's a window meter, bro. All right, let's see what kind of knot is we looking at. 18 knots? 18 knots. Reporting 18 knots on the wind, bro. Not sure the direction, but uh, hopefully they don't ask. Okay, let's go ahead and drop that. Let's see. We got 18 knots. Where's my, where's my thermometer at, bitch? Oh, it's right here. It's inside. Okay, that would not be accurate. Just for the record, gang, that would not be accurate. 46.4. Okay. Cloud conditions, number of hikers assisted. Okay, let me stand up. Oh, I'd say lightly cloudy. It's a little cloudy, I would say. Number of hikers, zero reported by... What the fuck is my name, bro? Wait a minute, wait a minute. Employee training and- Welcome to Ironbark State Park. If you're watching this video, then let me be the first to say, congratulations. You have been commissioned by the Ironbark Fire Department to protect one of the most prestigious parks in the state of Washington. Established in 1897, we have been known as one of the safest parks in America. We hope you can keep it that way for many years to come. This training video will ensure that you work to the best of your abilities. You have been selected as one of our Fire Lookout Observers. This is a truly rewarding job which requires many hours of hard work. You will be working in our state-of-the-art Lookout Towers. And the following is a list of responsibilities you will have. Keep watch for fire! Fire isn't going to be noticeable all of the time, so also keep watch for smoke. Make sure to know what color the smoke is. It may be crucial information. Fires are best stopped before they spread out of hand. Keep records of daily temperature. When the temperature rises, it is best that we have those recorded. The science nerds at the Panoramic Preservation Society require us to note all changes in temperature. We think it's best not to get into a lawsuit. Keep records of daily wind speed. Wind is a big factor when it comes to fire. Use the anemometer to scientifically gather the data. After collecting the data, input it into our state-of-the-art service reporting form. This is a highly complicated form, often used by NASA employees. So don't be too ashamed if you can't figure it out at first. You have the privilege of using such a form. Keep campers out of unregistered campgrounds. The campers might start a campfire which could lead to a wildfire. They will not always listen to authority, so take precaution when escorting them. Make sure to know whether the person is a threat. If you're worried about your safety, do not hesitate to dial 911. Keep maintenance of the park. Make sure the park is kept clean. We have a status to uphold. Now that you know most of the duties that a fire lookout has, you're ready to start. We hope that you have a great season out there on the tower. Try not to damage any of the equipment. And remember, if you see smoke, don't joke. Call the authorities and notify them of the predicament immediately. No way, that frizzy haired fuck is giving me a breakdown of my forest duties. That 
bitch. Understood. Okay, what is this? Cats? Plant. We are back. So how do you ah, feel? I had never them cancerous ass videos. Hi, everyone. I'm... Okay, so that flash media needs to be obliterated off of the uh, surface of this planet. Okay, this shit is not a game, bro. What the fuck is my name? Okay, I need to, I need to, I need to, I need to look here, bro. What the hell is my name? Um, I think I took a picture of my ID, right? This is definitely a setup. Oh, there it is, Jack Nelson. That's my bitch ass. Okay, wait, wait, wait let me back out. Okay, here we go. Bazinga. Send that ass in. Wasn't sure if I put in the right weather condition. What the fuck are you talking about? Oh, they don't like that? Are we going to call that clear? We are going to call that clear. Understood. Okay, so there we go. Yeah, yeah, I'm right here. What's up? Tower 11 copy. I think I'm going to sign off for the day. Understood. Tower 12, signing off. You have a good night, new guy. Will do, boss man. Uh, good night, Connor. Talk to you tomorrow. Good night. Over and out. Okay, so I went ahead and sent that in. My man signed off. Uh, I should have signed off as well, but I didn't. That's fine. Let's let's hit the let's hit the sheets, Bo. Uh, I always close the boards outside before heading to bed. Why? I mean, I guess it would help with the temperature, but that's the only logical thing, Bo. Uh, if you are a high IQ gamer, you should always have a sleep mask. Okay, and a sleep mask means you don't need to close the damn boards because the sun ain't gonna wake your ass up no way. Whatever. Let me close up the boards. All right, let's get to bed. Oh, look at this, Bo. Oh, yeah. Okay, so they got the... They got the bullshit started right away, Bo. With the uh, with the crouch next to the window, and it fucking raises the shits. Okay, y'all know y'all know that's a setup. Okay, y'all know that's a setup. 3.26 a.m. Why am I up at 3.26 a.m.? Unintelligible. 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 Okay, well, let's get the fuck up and see what's unintelligible. Who's conversating? Uh, Connor? I had to pee. Of course I did. Am I not concerned about the random radio static that I just got? Apparently not. Where's my flashlight? Let me take the bear spray with me, okay? In case somebody tries to bamboozle me, I'm about to bear spray they bitch ass. Where is my flashlight? There we go. Alright, let's hit the streets. Okay, on my first night, being out of the cabin gave me a strange feeling. Wait, being left alone was somewhat unsettling. Oh, wait, am I just gonna pee off at the side? Ball. Gang. Gang. Okay, you see what I'm saying? There's definitely something going on with the amount of PP time you spend on this game. There's somebody down there at the bottom. Y'all see him? Hope bitch enjoys the show, goddammit. Hope bitch enjoyed this show, goddammit. That's what we call a 10 inch long, motherfucker. Fat. Okay, so buddy down there watching, bro. I mean, obviously you can see him. Let me get the binocs real quick. Huh. Now, who's that there? Oh, that's that creep in my fucking minivan. Or not in my minivan. But in my, uh, in my, uh, in my, uh, whatchamacallit. Living in my camper van, no doubt. He tracked my ass, and now he knows where I be staying at. Hmm. That's muy interesante. Okay, so that's what they did. That's what they wanted me to see on my pee pee trip. Night two. Okay, so do we not do anything during the day? It's just you and the wind, and the time just melts it away. We give that shit a big sip of rooski, bro. Looking out for a fire. Looking out for any kind of creepity creep creeps that might be out here stalking me. Take a photo. Take a photo with what? I got a, I got a camera? Let me take a picture. Uh, I feel like maybe they're going to want me to. So there we go. Do you copy? This yeah. Connor from Tower 12. Do you copy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let, me, let, me, let me get to you, Connor. Hold up. What's up, boss man? Do you copy? Copy that, Connor. What's up? Son of a bitch. What? Nobody bothers to get a camping permit these days anymore. Oh. Do you have eyes on the smoke north of your position? Uh, let me take a look. Oh, damn. Okay, I'm kind of bumping right now, gang. 
Yes, sir. Yes, sir. North of my position. Oh, yeah, sure do. Yeah. Yeah. It's that. Oh, my God, bitch. Okay, when you zoom in on this joint, I mean, it is sensitive as a motherfucker. You got to creep with that ass, bro. Otherwise, otherwise, that bitch snaps around nasty. Okay, so we got some uh, white smoke approximately. Eh, I'd say about a click to the north. I need you to confirm. I'm you coming. See that smoke up north? Yeah, I do. Hold up. Hang tight. Hang tight. You spot that white smoke up north? Yeah, yeah, I see it. It appears to be in the lazy trail sector, which is not a registered campsite. Right. People like that don't bother to clean up after themselves. The fire risks are high this season. Am I checking it out? What? Okay, I'm heading north. I'll report back. Yes, do you have any other details? Is it safe? Be alert. Carry your bear spray, and you should be fine. Okay. Right, 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 right. Uh, do you have any other no details? No information at the moment. Just follow Lazy Trail. Keep an eye out for any signs of a campfire or any potential hazards along the way. All Stay right. Stay safe out there. Don't forget to carry your bear spray in these woods, new guy. Over and out. Understood, boss man. Now, as far as I'm concerned, bear spray is almost more potent of a weapon than a gun. Because bear spray would incapacitate literally anyone or anything that might want to fuck with you. So let me go ahead and get my bear spray. Grab this. Can I also take my compass? I can't, bitch. My hands are full. Okay, well, that makes it simple. I'm definitely taking... Oh, my God, bitch. I just used some of my bear spray. All right, let's hit the streets, folks. 8.37 p.m. Ooh, not the creepy spooky music. I followed the trail that led me to the smoke. Oh shit. Some bitch like they just got terminated. Watch the fuck out. No camping. Violators will be sighted. Okay. So somebody's up here yelling, but somebody just got murdered. Nasty of that, I have no doubt. Okay, so she just got my text message. Um... Somebody just got carved up out of this bit. Oh, my God. I just pepper sprayed the desk, bro. I just pepper sprayed the fucking desk. Who yelled out here, bro? How do I get in here? Do I have limited bear spray? Because this is fucking unbelievable that I just keep spraying it. Who's there? Step out here. You don't see anything? Triple dot, triple dot. Show yourself. The area beyond the site was closed. Okay, so what am I going to do? Okay, so what am I finna do? Somebody was whistling. Somebody was whistling back in that joint. Am I supposed to... Okay, that's the frequency. That's the nearest tower. I'm minorly confused. What the... Am I supposed to... Can I, should I put out the fire? My hands were full. Oh, my God. Okay, so let me drop my weapon in order to put out the fire. No fires allowed. Bitch, fire risk is high, goddammit. You think this shit's a fucking game? You can't be doing that. Put that shit out! All right, now, if you want to bring your ass up and out of the woods, you can do it. But at a minimum, I'm going to be putting this fire out. Why can't I get some more water? Oh, it went out. It went out. Okay. So I've gone ahead and put the fire out. Uh, Looks like these people came bopping out of that tent in a hurry, bro. Okay, so fire's out. I guess I'll just send the I'll just send the officers up here tomorrow. Okay, somebody in the woods, they about to get bear spray, bitch. This is this military grade pepper spray. This shit is not a game. I as I hiked back to my tower through the dark, I couldn't shake the sense. Something was terribly wrong. My mind couldn't help but think what might have happened. Uh-huh. Okay, fair point, bitch. Fair point, bitch. Uh Connor Tower 12, do you copy? Hey Connor, do you copy? I was just cooking myself some hot well first what's your status uh you let's talk about me? the campsite son of a bitch they never learn do they uh what do you mean i'm sick of these bastards it's unbelievable uh has this been happening a lot this is the third time this month alone right is it the third day in the month or is it like at the end of the month because depending it could be more or less reasonable anything else you notice in those woods Mention the scream. The scream? Must have been one of those red foxes. They sound pretty much like a screaming lady at night. Oh, it was a pretty manly scream. I don't know what you're talking about, new guy. But I heard from the rangers that a lot of campers have been flocking to that area lately because of the disappearance of those three kids. What kids went missing? About a month ago. They were hiking with their families. They went off the trail and just vanished. No trace of them since.
What does that have to do with the campers? Well, people have started spreading rumors that the area might be haunted by some entities. Ah! Nobody mentioned that shit to me before I took the fucking job! It's crazy, I know. You would think these rumors would scare people off, but apparently it's been the opposite. Bruh. Sometimes, I only wish they were true. Bruh, what are you talking about? Well, at least now you know why Mitch had to staff Tower 11 urgently. That's unsettling. You guy? I hope you don't believe those rumors. Do you? Oh, absolutely not. No. I, yeah, I do, bitch! The fuck! Okay, I'm not trying to get terminated at this fucking cringe-ass job, bro. Great. Anyways, thanks for staying vigilant. I gotta contact the authorities so they can take care of this commotion first thing in the morning. We can't tolerate these goons anymore. Understood. If they find them, I'll personally make sure they never set foot in this forest again. Keep me updated. Will do. Over and out. Over and out. Okay, so let's just do a quick survey around because I'm certain we're about to start getting off uh, with here pretty quick. Now, am I supposed to start just doing my end of night routine? Or what am I supposed to be doing here? Okay, let's put my back to the wall, not to the door. Let's see what these messages say, Bo. Can't respond. Okay, so I got I got no signal at the tower. Uh, okay, here's the pictures I sent. Hope, hope everything is okay. Looking at the phone, uh, photo makes my stomach growl. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna try that recipe now. Okay, right, so we just compensate, no biggie. I was too hungry to go to bed without food. Okay, so it's, it's nice to click on things to be able to tell what the hell you're supposed to be doing. Uh, let me see if I can't get my cook game on here real quick. Put down my bear spray. At this point, I was starving. Uh, I had to get all the ingredients Kayla's recipe asked for. Okay, how am I finna do that? Is there a cupboard in this bitch or what? Oh, here we go. Okay, right. Understood. I need to check the ingredients list again. Of course I do. Shit's a setup. Oh. Okay, so... Uncooked pasta, marinara sauce, pepperoni, mozzarella cheese, diced tomatoes. What the f*** is this? This is stir fry. Okay, is that gonna go back in the fridge or... What is this? This shit got meat? Pepperoni uncooked pasta. Bro, I'm pulling out all kinds of bullshit that ain't right. Okay, here we go. We got some uncooked pasta. Pop that shit in there. I'm looking for some marinara sauce. Is that refrigerated or no? Oh, here go the marinara. Bazinga. Pepperoni. We got that in the fridge? Yes, we do. Mozzarella and diced tomatoes. Diced tomatoes. Garden peas, milk. And you can't put shit back into the fridge. Okay, I know y'all think I'm just being a wasteful ghoul, but you, you, you can't put it back in the fridge. Okay, I'm pretty sure that's the full thing. Uncooked pasta, marinara, pepperoni, diced tomatoes. Okay, okay, right. So let's put this shit in the oven. Bazinga! Let that ass cook. Close up the fridge, but we wasted all kinds of electricity in this dumb bitch! <laughs> Okay, everybody stay calm, everybody stay relaxed. Well, everybody stay calm, everybody stay relaxed. New guy, you there? Yeah, what's up, boss man? New guy, you copy? Yeah, 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 I'm here. What's up? Connor, what's up? Uh, just reported their ass to the authorities. Nice, okay, what did they say? Don't worry, the Forest Service Agency will take care of it first thing in the morning. That's, uh, relieving. Hope they can track them down and give them a piece of their mind. Hopefully. Keep an eye on things from here. You stay vigilant for such smoke moving forward. Uh, that's the duty I chose. Speaking of duty, I don't see your name here. Did you report for the night yet? Uh, I was just getting it out. You better get to it. Mitch didn't sound to be in a very good mood today. You got it, boss man. What? I think I'm gonna hit the sack now. I know it's been a tough day, but you're doing an excellent job up there. Ah, uh, thanks, Con. Appreciate that. Good night. Good night, Connor. Over and out. All right, boss, man. So let's go ahead and let's get us a couple of uh, measure mounts. Okay, because y'all know I got a mean measurement game. What, what's our knot looking like? 19. Not a Ruski's, baby cakes. All right, bring it back in. Drop that ass down. 19 knots. All right, let me get the temperature real quick. 
Coming in at Bowman uh, 47.7. Okay, didn't save my last measurement, apparently. Appreciate that. I would say clear. Hikers assisted today, zero. Reported by Jack Nelson. Submit! Had to put the right weather condition. Okay, so what are we calling that? Because that's the exact same weather condition it was yesterday, and yesterday it was clear. Are we calling this one cloudy? This, it's literally identical. What the fuck ever, bro? Okay, whatever. It's literally the exact same, but I... Okay, cloud. Submitted, bazinga. Okay. Huge for the program. My shit done? Perfect timing, baby cakes. Remember? Okay, all right, here we go. I liked eating in bed. Right, so I'm a crusty son bitch. Let me go ahead and eat this joint. How do I eat? Am I eating? Oh. Oh, here we go, gang. It's a setup. All right, keep your eyes open. They don't they don't have you sitting here eating for no no reason at all. Who going to pop up, bro? Keep your eyes on the windows, gang. Keep your eyes on the windows, gang. Somebody about to pop up and say, "Hi, Dommy." Some bitch. I was already full. Oh, dead ass real talk. Dead ass real talk for serious. Ain't nobody gonna pop up and say hi to me. I put my leftovers up. All right, let's close up shop. And one more for the road. There it is, baby. Okay, so everything's closed up. Do one last fire check for the night while we're out here. Make sure we don't see nothing suspicious. Connor has indeed gone to bed. I can tell that from the uh, lack of light coming from his tower. No smoke to be seen. Nobody on my stairs. All right, let's hit the hay. It was gonna get cold. I needed to get wood for the stove, fucker! Okay, just kidding. Let me take it down and around town. I can't bring the bear spray because I gotta be able to carry the wood. And if I brought the bear spray, I wouldn't be able to use it. Or I wouldn't be able to bring it back up and that would be even worse. All right, we're probably gonna get jump scared here, gang, so be ready. Be ready! It's not letting me check it out. It's not letting me look. I tried to walk. There's an invisible wall. I'm, I'm bouncing. Okay, let me open this. Pitch that ass. Is it going to give it to me? Do I need the gasoline? Son of a bitch, you do. Okay, I didn't think you did need the gasoline, but you definitely do. Okay, drop it. Pull it, light it, throw it. Bazinga. Huge for the program. There we go. Matches right next to gasoline. Who needs it, bitch? Take your ass to sleep. Okay, we got, we got a mean wake up and pee pee in the middle of the night game or what? Yes, we do. There it is. 2.27 a.m. Bitch, that shit is not a game. I woke up. Wait, I was woken up by some feeling that caused my eyes to drift open. I just saw a flashlight. Wait, bro, what the fuck? I just saw somebody, somebody pee pee in my shit. Wait, there's something very strange about that night. Huh? Oh, God! Oh, there's something very strange indeed. There's a goddamn master that bitch that guard my ass up. I got fucking terminated. Bro, I got fucking terminated. Stop. It better have saved the game, bro. Oh, it did. Thank God, bitch. What the fuck? Okay, gang, gang, gang. Do not mind the wardrobe change, you bitch. Okay, I had to take Zez to the vet when we recorded this originally. I was woken up by a feeling... Oh, yeah, look at this bitch, Bo, that caused my eyes to awaken. Okay, so this bitch, Bitch McGee, up here, scheming nasty on me. Okay, so they got a goddamn satanic cult worshiper out here f***ing with my ass right off the break. Now, if you go outside, this bitch got a mean suplex your bitch ass game. So I'm not going outside to get suplexed. Hold up, gang. What's the move here? So do I just... There was something very strange about that night. Oh, he about to jump me? Wait, I'm not about to be... Is, is that my dog? Oh, he's walking by. I think he's leaving. Okay, I think maybe my door is locked. I fabricated that motherfucker, but I... I need it to be true. 
Where is my damn flashlight slash bear spray, bitch? I should be sleeping with that shit A1 ready to rock, okay? If I don't got a Glock, that's that shit I need, bro. They're not gonna give me any of my shit. They're not gonna give me any of my shit. No, because if, if they did, I would just go outside and pepper spray that bitch. I gotta go look out. I'm cooked. Oh my god, this bitch left me a motherfucking... He left me a little present. And then he left. Oh, god damn and golly! I didn't know what to make of it at the moment. Uh, the only logical thing I could think was to contact Connor. Okay, let's go ahead and close that shit immediately. Okay, wow, 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 wow. That bitch creeping on me. Let me hit up Connor, bro. Let me hit up Connor real quick. Connor, do you copy? Uh, I need to talk to you. It's urgent. You there? Do you have any idea what time it is? There's something outside my door. Just couldn't wait until morning. Mention the skull. Tell you what, Sukai. It's probably best to ignore these kids messing around. I suspect that's what Marley got tired of. Bo, I don't think these are kids messing around. What if it's not a prank? These kids can be pretty creative with these pranks. They watch too many horror movies. Maybe they thought it would be funny. It feels like... Some sort of real ritual. This is serious. You don't understand, do you? Let's not get carried away, new guy. We're in the middle of nowhere. All right. Okay. Here's what we'll do. I'll send someone to check in on you tomorrow. For now, just lock your door, take a deep breath, and try to get some rest. We can't do much in the dark. Oh my god. This motherfucker want me hanging from a stake, bitch! Oh my god. I'm about to get devil burned. Okay, I don't know what the fuck they do with the satanic rituals, bitch, but I'm about to find out! <laughs> I'm saying triple dot. I'm not gonna say thanks. Connor didn't make any sense. But there's not much else I could do in the dark. What's what's what, what's that shadow right there, Bo? So can I lock my door? Is that a thing? How do you lock that some bitch? I guess I'm just going back to bed. I'm cooked, bitch. Oh my god, I'm cooked nastier than a motherfucker on a Sunday, bitch. Are you cooked nasty? What am I talking about? Sometimes I just say random shit. The next day I woke up not being so sure last night was real or a dream. Connor tried to reason it was a harmless prank by some kids, but there's something about that night that just felt darker. There is something strange happening in those woods. 8:34 p.m. Okay, bitch, so we jump cutting right to the night time. Okay, so wait. I can't move. I've got my binocs out. I occupied most of my days either with simple maintenance in and around the tower. Sir, or by scanning the density of the trees around me. My paranoia for these woods only grew after last night, which led me to be extra vigilant moving forward. Okay, well... I'm not seeing nothing, bitch. And when I did see something the first time, Big Buddy didn't even respond about it. Oh, you can clean them. Oh, I thought that was just dog shit fucking cringe vision. But you can clean that ass. Okay, not really sh Oh, bitch set up a flare. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Somebody set up a flare. Who set up a flare? Wait a minute, gang. What the fuck? Who done did that? Okay, so wait, 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 so so I saw the flare go up. Now the fuck what? Let me, Hello? let me. Is anyone there? Okay, here's. Uh, I need help. Wait, that's not Connor? Who's that? Please, someone answer. Wait, I didn't feel comfortable facing my back to the open door. Okay, understood. Actually, fair point. It's not even nighttime yet, and that's a fair point. Hello? Can anyone hear me? This is, this is Jack Tower 11. Uh. Thank goodness, uh, I'm lost, and I'm I'm really starting to freak out. Take a deep breath. Okay. okay. <sighs> What's going on? I I don't even know where to start. I, I went out to explore the area and lost track of time. Okay. And, and now it's dark, and I can't remember the trail back to my truck. Oh, okay. I think, I think I'm lost. Can you describe your clothing? What is your current location? What equipment do you have with you? I have a flashlight, a compass, a fully charged two-way radio, a flare gun, and, and some of my camping equipment. 
Oh, so if you got your camping equipment, just just camp till the morning. Can you describe your clothing? What's your current location? Uh, I'm in the middle of the woods, on this trail surrounded by trees. Everything looks different at night. I thought shooting a few flare gun shots might get someone's attention, but no one's come yet. Right. All I did was light up the trees and make everything look even scarier. I just want to find a way out of here. Okay, well this bitch should definitely not be doing any more solo exploring. This bitch ain't built for it. Can you describe your surroundings? Can you remember any landmarks? What direction are you facing right now? Let's do landmarks. I, I remember passing a small stream earlier. Um, okay, what direction are you facing right now? I'm walking towards west right now because I remember walking east when I came here. Right. Oh, thank goodness. I see it. See, wait, see what? I'm at a trail intersection now, but I can't remember if I should take the right trail or the left to get back to the trailhead. Can you help me? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Let me, uh, let me check the map and get back to you. Okay, wait, where the fuck is this guy at? Wait a minute. Buddy talking about passing a small stream earlier and facing west currently. Wait, oh, wait, wait, wait. Can I ask him? Oh, oh, I forgot the map's on the computer. Okay. So uh, hello? Uh, are, are you still there? Yeah, yeah, my man. I'm All trying of to... these trails seem pretty similar. Uh, I'm just so anxious about making a mistake and going further away from the road. Please help. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got you, I got you. trail intersection now, but I can't remember if I should take the right trail or the left to get back to the trailhead. Can you help me? Let me scan the map, my man. Let me scan the map. So he said he passed a creek. So he said he passed a creek. And some time ago, he passed... Didn't he say he passed uh, a creek? Hello? Bitch, stop! Uh, are, are you still there? Both of these trails seem pretty similar. I, I'm just so anxious. Okay. My man, so, so he said he's facing west, okay, and he's got a compas, so technically he should know where he's going. I'm not gonna lie, I wasn't paying a whole lot of attention to, 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 to which one, uh, or to, like, where he was at properly. Now, I, I'm assuming he's over here, maybe, because he said he passed a creek, which this is, some time ago, um... But I thought he also said he passed a pond. I don't I don't know where the fuck this guy is at. I should have been paying more attention. I really should have been paying more attention. He said he passed a creek. That that I remember for certain. But there's a lot of creeks, bitch. Um I need him to retell me where he was at. I did, I honestly didn't I'm at a trail intersection now, but I can't remember if I should take the right trail or the left to get back to the trailhead. Can you help? The right trail or the... Back to the trail. Okay, the trailhead's here. Is this the only trailhead? There is, bitch. There is! Okay, so he said he's facing west. And he passed a creek. Son of a bitch, so he's actually uh, hello? here. Hello? Stop! Uh, both of these trails seem pretty similar. Uh, I'm just so... Okay, stop telling me that. I'm gonna make you more anxious by punching you in the head! Okay, so I actually think... This is where he's at. So a wrong turn would send this man on a hiatus to hell. Okay, and I'm not trying to send him on a hiatus to hell. So he wants to take the left trail. Okay, that's going to take him to Logan Pass Trailhead, the only trailhead on the map. Okay, I got I, I, I got to believe that's where he's at. Left trail, my man. I'm at a trail intersection now, but... I, left trail. Ah, I knew it. I thought it looked familiar. No, you didn't fuck I off. couldn't have trusted myself with this decision. <laughs> Thanks for helping me through this. You're welcome. You're welcome. What do you mean? I hear you. Wait, you hear me? I hear your whistles. That's not me. What? What? I see you behind the trees to my right. That's not me. You're freaking me out. Run! Oh my god, I can't tell him to run. I got. It gave me the pop up for one micro millisecond. Now. Oh my god, it's not a real pause. Peek. Oh, hell no! Hi! Hi! How long are you gonna knock for? I forgot you can't make noise underneath the shit. That's why it acts as my microphone. Bro, I'm not gonna answer that the fuck.
I saw what I needed to. Where's my bear spray? This guy, this guy got a mean knock forever game, so let me get my bear spray real quick. There it is. Okay, so get rid of this shit. <laughs> spray! Oh god! I pepper sprayed Connor's dumbass! Okay, first of all, I peeked. That is not what it looked like. Okay, first of all, I peeked. That is not what it looked like. But this guy got a mean impervious to bear spray game. His ass should be in a hospital right now. But I just blasted his ass nasty. But I'm sorry about that. Holy moly, what took you so long in there? I've been knocking for hours. Uh, I was asked to check in on you. What were you up to, pal? I'm assisting a lost hiker. I'm just finishing up a report. At this hour, may Lord be merciful. Anyways, got your tower supplies here. Just the usual essentials. Here you go. I feel like I'm going to pass out if I keep holding this for one more second. Okay, so my man, you want to stay the night or? I only got one to in bed, but you can sleep on the fucking wood paneling on the floor. Triple dot, triple dot, triple dot. What were you doing there last night? What do you mean? Up north. Why were you up there? I wouldn't screw around up there, pal. I was required to investigate on a campfire smoke. Oh, Lord, have mercy. Nasty business up there, pal. Bobcats and bears. You be careful out there, pal. These woods aren't normal. And there's stuff out there that would love to get a piece of you. Not to mention, you'd be quite a distance from help if anything happened. Um, I've got enough to keep me occupied here. Absolutely, it's a busy job, triple dot. I've been hearing you've been a bit on edge. Everything all right? Just getting used to the new environment. Mention the skull. Triple dot. Triple dot. Oh, Lord have mercy. Oh, this is this motherfucker's favorite line. Bo, give me some constructive information here. Did you take a photo of it before cleaning it up? No, I didn't think about it. You know, it's best we don't dwell on these things, pal. Besides, we can't do anything without the evidence. Triple dot. Anyways, it's getting late. I better get going now. Just keep watch. Thanks for the supplies. My man, you might get terminated on the way out of here. You better watch the fuck out now. Uh, that was really bad timing for him to arrive. Okay, that was really bad timing for him to arrive. This guy needs, this guy's dead. This guy's dead. He got cooked. I, I I didn't have the time to click run. Boy, it literally popped up for maybe half a second before he knocked on my dough. Before he, I mean, what the hell? What am I doing now? Wait, am I supposed to be doing something with the supplies? Where do, what, are, what are the supplies? I don't even understand what the supplies are. I guess I'm just supposed to like file my report then, right? That would be Mr. Jack Nelson. Submit. I wasn't sure if I, Okay, so it is cloudy. Okay, so really the first day... What the fuck are they... What are they talking about? What's wrong with my weather condition? What is it, Misty? Oh, they probably want Misty, actually. Let me slap down a Misty, Bo. Or a Windy. Is Windy an option? Wind. There we go. Okay, it like that shit. It like that shit. Clear, cloudy, clear. Has Connor reported in, Bo? That's interesting. Connor hasn't reported in. Over at Tower 12. Huh. Okay, all right. Well, let's go ahead and get that ass up. Let me go ahead and drop my window meter. Okay, don't really need that at the moment. Do need my flashlight, okay, because it could get dark out of this bitch. And then y'all know I need the pepper spray while I go outside and close up my joint. Where'd the pepper spray go? Boy, I blasted that some bitch. There it is. Okay, let's check this shit out real quick. Oh, 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 fuck! Okay, I just, I, I, honest to God, if it's windy, I probably would pepper spray myself in that situation. Okay, I ain't seeing nothing. I might have to start the, the, the fire though, right? Usually you gotta do that before bed. I was too hungry to go to bed without food. Good thing I got my leftovers. Wait a second. Let me leave this by the front door. Nice and easy to access. I like to sit down while I eat. Okay, I already know what this shit's gonna say. Let me get grub. How do I eat it? The food was cold. Okay. 
Wait, isn't this is a metal dish? That looks like a metal dish. I'm certainly not gonna I am, okay. So I put the metal dish into the microwave. Any low IQ gamers tell me why that's a bad fucking idea! Dami, relax. Bro, the eating noises are insane on this game. I'm not gonna lie. Give it to me. One more. Am I seeing movement outside that window? I think it's just a tree. All right, let's get my ass up. Let's get my ass up and get prepped for bed, bro. I mean, will it be my last night on this earth? Almost certainly. But all the same, let's get prepped. Okay, got to go get the wood for the stove. I can't carry wood and my bear spray, and I can't risk leaving that down here, bro. Oh, but there's bear spray down here. Wait, there's all the implements down here. Oh, God! Who the fuck is that? Oh my god, bald built like a bowling ball ass bitch. You just gave me a heart attack. I understand loneliness can make the mind play tricks on you. What the fuck are you talking about? What are you doing here? No need to be alarmed. I'm a worker. I was just doing some routine maintenance on the radio tower over there. Thought I'd say hi to the new guy everybody's been talking about. Uh, do you usually work this late? Every Sunday, just trying to keep the communication lines open. We must ensure that the right message reached the right places, wouldn't you agree? Right. We rely on that information about the fire sightings. I agree, fire risks are high this season. Absolutely. But some fires are meant to burn. And there is no amount of prevention that can stop them. Okay, I'm just going to triple dot this some bitch. Nature has its own plan. Some things can't be controlled, no matter how hard we try. And sometimes, disasters are just another form of cleansing. A way for the land to purify itself. Uh, I better head back to the tower now. Have a good night, Jack. You sleep well, but remember, curiosity can lead to places you'd rather not go. Farewell, Jack. Okay, hold on a sec. My man, hold up. You son of a bitch! You son of a bitch! Terminated his ass. Terminated his fucking ass! Okay, so let me do that. Open it, light it, toss it, pitch it, close it, close it, bop it. There it is. I see the smoke coming out of your tower. Don't tell me you're not in there. Huh? New guy. You there? But what are you talking about? Don't tell me you're not there. The fuck are you talking about? What's up? You copy now. Loud and clear. Finally. I've been trying to reach you for a while now. Where have you been? Went down to get some firewood. Ran into this guy downstairs. Ran into who? Uh-huh. Here you go, gang. That bitch don't work here. That bitch don't work here! The guy maintaining the nearby radio tower. <sighs> Just about yesterday. What do you mean? You trying to yank my chain? What do you mean? That radio tower's been out of service for ages now. Uh, it was closed sorry. down years what? ago after a lightning strike fried its systems. Its repair costs was deemed too costly. Oh, is that the truth? So there's not a creepy bald-headed bowling ball built motherfucker out here. Its repair date was postponed until the next big funding, which is no time soon, according to Mitch. Then who the hell did I talk to? Look, if what you're saying is true, it could be another one of those goons pranks on you. He knew my name. Knew your name? You think he's been listening? Uh, yeah. I'm sure he has. Either way, disguising as a staff member is strictly forbidden according to park guidelines. Next time you see him, get his information or take a photo. We need to figure this out. Bro, send the police! Anyways, I'm seeing that you've already reported. I think I'm gonna hit the sack now. Yeah, me too. Tower 12, signing off. Over and out. Good night. Over and out. Okay, so I'm cooked like a tendy, bro. I'm cooked like a fucking chicken tendy. I'm dead as hell. Now, I don't know why these motherfuckers keep talking out here about having a camera to take pictures with. I don't got a camera, bro. So I don't know how they expect me to be taking no pictures. Whatever. You know I'm going to bed double strap, gang. Yeah, that's right. Flashlight in one hand, 
pepper spray in the other. Not that it seems to be particularly effective. My unease was starting to grow with each passing day. So when I signed off that night, I told myself that it was a change of environment that I needed getting used to. The strangeness I'd seen so far in those woods was not enough to cause alarm yet. However, that would soon change. Two nights later. Okay, here we go. 9, 18 p.m. Please tell me the sun hasn't set. Please tell me the sun hasn't set. Oh, and you got it's you. rain. You got a minute? I'm listening. Well, good news. Just heard from the HQ. They say we've got a new system update on the computer. Why is that good news? Mitch wanted me to let you know. They say it's an important security update. Okay. Or no snoopers, I guess. Uh, thanks for letting me know. How do I update the computer? What is it about? Wait. Well, to be honest with you, all this new technology, it's not really my thing. Dare I say it, these computers are probably going to take all our jobs one day. Correct. Anyways, for now, use the console to run the new system update. I'm sure a young man like you can figure it out. Uh, thanks. I got it. Thanks for letting me know on it. Okay, so let's get this console update running. Uh, help. Update. Please enter the package update code. Hold on a sec. Wait a minute, I'm trying to get out of the computer? Wait a minute. Do we have a situation? Just hearing a lot of bullshit, bro. I know, I know it's raining outside, stormy a little bit, but I ain't tripping none. Four three four six zero eight four. Please enter an active line. Busy lines, serviceable lines. Oh, I see. You gotta see which ones aren't on here. So fifty four eighty seven. B E A beautiful bitch. Got that ass. Okay, so updates. What the hell? Did my generator just cut off? Power was out. Of course it fucking did. Of course it did! Uh-oh, gang. Uh-oh, gang. Okay, we about to have us a Class 32 type situation. I'm bodied. Get ready to spray a bitch, bro. Be ready to spray a bitch, bro. Let me go check out our... I know it's gonna tell me that the generator is out of fuel. But what I don't know is if I'm gonna meet the devil. Claire! Let me get over here. I got drenched in the rain. I gotta get this gas real quick. Probably gonna get jumped. Do not yell. Do not yell, gang. Is that thing ready to go? I was getting cold and I had to pee. No worries, gang. Let me get the pepper spray. All right, let's get moving. Oh, do they want me to go into the your, or, or into the porta potty? They do. Oh God, please no. Wait a minute, I can cheese. Oh, I'm hiding. Oh, I was hiding. I... Wait, I just tried to pee. I'm super confused. Oh. Where did my bear spray go? Don't yell. Wait, that ass nothing. Where's my fucking bear spray? Wait a minute, gang. I'm taking the reserve. I'm taking the reserve. This shit is not a game. This shit is not a game! Okay, who finna get blasted, bo? I'll send some, some bitch to the stars. I'll send the motherfucker to the stars, bo. Why is this a load scene? Why is this a load scene?
One week later. What? Wait, I, th I thought something weird was supposed to happen. Time was flying by. Connor's generator was under maintenance, which meant I had to cover his areas for the past two days. When there was no fires going, the only thing I'd do is check in on Connor twice a day. That might have been the only time I ever talked, unless I was talking to myself. Oh my god, the middle of the fucking morning. We got another one. We got another one, says Connor. I know it's late, but you're gonna wanna see this one, Jack. Jack? Jack? I need you to wake up. You copy? This son of a bitch. Okay, nobody's stalking me at the moment. That's good. Let me sit my ass down and see what's popping. Jack, you copy? Right here, Connor. Okay, tell you what. I don't have the energy to do this right now. What happened? I've been here busting my ass, working on that old piece of garbage generator. Okay. But now I'm seeing this. I'm seeing more smoke to my west. Looks like we got another camper. Bro. It appears to be in your sector. You see the campsite from your end? Let me have a look. Okay, so we got a we got a campsite out into the west that we need to investigate. I just see some shit. Oh no, it's a shadow gang. You know what? I don't have it in me to deal with this crap tonight. I'm gonna let you deal with this one. If they don't run away this time, take their photos and IDs. And if things get worse, don't hesitate to call HQ for help. Update me tomorrow morning. I'm gonna get some rest. Bro. I'm pretty sure Connor might be a op. I'm not gonna lie. I think Connor might be a op, bro. He, he, he always spotting some bullshit for me to go check out. And never wants to go check it out for himself. I mean, that looks like it could be in his zone too, bro. Oh, come on. I didn't know what to make of it. They're burning a dead man. What do you mean you didn't know what to make of it? The only thing that made sense at the time was to take evidence of it. Okay, so, yeah, Connor's definitely a op. But I think it's in your zone. Really? It looks like it's between us, you bitch. The fuck you mean that's in my zone? He, he on that side of the river. Do they want me to go out to the side? I'm not documenting from up here. Oh, wait, there. Take a photo. Okay, there we go. Yeah, this will be good enough, bro. I hope this bitch don't have its flash on. <gasps> it fucking did. I'm a goddamn goblotic fool. I'm done, Zos. I'm done with the clown. They're already here. How could that son of a bitch already be here? Oh, that's cool. Sit your ass down! Look at this some bitch. Wait, how do you get busted? Wait, does, is this even real? I want to see if this shit's real. Is this shit even real? Is this shit even real, you fucking bitch? You ain't shit, you motherfucker. I feel like this honestly might not even be a real thing. I feel like it might honestly not even be a real thing. Oh God, for serious, I knew it!
God damn it, bitch. God damn it! Huh? What's up, dumbass? To what? Move. Move. I think I'm sprinting. I think this is the sprint. I think this is the sprint, ladies and gentlemen. I do believe this is the sprint. This bitch gonna overtake. God, you son of a bitch, you're supposed to hide in the porta potty. You're supposed to hide in the fucking porta potty because you heard this shit. But when it does that noise, you're cooked. When you when it does that noise, you're cooked. What's good, bitch, bitch? Move. I threw my fucking flashlight. Whatever. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Huh? Why does the damn door not fucking close? Is that not what you're supposed to do? Is that not what the fuck you're supposed to do? I'm cheating, bro. This, this game's unbelievable, bro. This game's unbelievable. Bro, that is what you're supposed to do. Okay. Get rid of the Minox. I have to get in this shit! Bro, it's literally impossible. Trail Iron Park. I think I came from this way. I don't honestly know which way I came from, bro. I should have looked at the fucking map. I should have looked at the fucking map. I'm not stopping. Yeah, yeah, that's fine, bro. Son of a bitch! Oh my god! Oh my god! This bitch tested me. This bitch tested me. This bitch tested me! Yeah, what's up, bitch? What's up, bitch? Come get, come, 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 come get run over by the fucking Winnebago. As the adrenaline kicked in, I hit the gas and drove to the nearest ranger cabin. Out of breath, I radioed to alert HQ. Look, Jack, we all get a little sir crazy out there, Mitch answered. Bro. Next morning, authorities allegedly ran a small investigation in the area, but of course, they were met with no signs of misconduct. No one ever believed my story, dismissing it as a product of isolation. Just stick to looking for fires, Mitch offered. However, that was the last time I ever set foot in those woods. The unease still sits heavy on my stomach, even though many years have passed, the experience still vividly haunts my memory. My family thought I was making this whole thing up, which is really out of my character, but I know what I saw. Real or not, After Dark, the woods become a haven for illegal activities, so if any of you plan on going camping soon, please be safe. Gang. Gang. Stop with the fucking fabroni, bitch! Stop with the goddamn baloney, bitch! Stop fucking lying! Okay, let me tell you something. Now, don't, do not be afraid to go camping, okay? This game is dog shit! No, let me stop, let me stop. The game's not dog shit, okay? But the story is, 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 no, no, no! Okay, first of all, the guy literally took a picture with a camera of other people doing the illegal activities, and then suddenly nobody believed it. What happened to the picture? A critical part of the story! Related around the picture that he took that revealed his location that caused them bitches to come trip. But the picture disappeared. But the picture disappeared. You want to know why the picture disappeared? Because the story is fabricated. Ladies and gentlemen, go outside, go hiking, go camping. Do not be afraid of the woods. This game's fabricated. Hope y'all enjoyed the episode of Fears to Fathom, the Iron Bark Lookout. Touch grass, motherfuckers. Touch grass! Oh, sorry. Yo, I, 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 I got a personal vendetta against any game that advocates against going outside. Go outside, you dusty motherfuckers! Goodbye!